The civil defense siren, more commonly known as the air raid siren, is a mechanism that is used to warn the public in case of an emergency. They work by having a special impeller spin really fast inside of a specific enclosure that causes a very loud droning noise, and this is what we use to warn the public with. However, everywhere on the internet I've seen people 3D printing both electric and hand crank air raid sirens. So, since I have an air turbine, what if I made a air raid siren out of a air turbine? Hello everybody, my name is Axel, and I like to build stuff. I started this project by taking an air turbine I made in a previous video and making some major improvements. Namely, better bearings, a better axle, and better fittings for all the parts. After that very boring task, I decided to take the air raid siren off of Thingiverse, the link is in the description, and just slap it on the back of my air turbine because I did not want any extra mounts. After a bunch of hours of printing and 17 failed axles, I finally had it working and so after it was entirely assembled it was time for a test with just my lungs yeah this is just uh with my own breath let's see how loud it is <laughs> that's pretty cool <laughs> so it works terribly let me explain if you heard in the last clip, there was a bunch of rubbing on the impeller, and that's probably from it being imbalanced. So after designing a smaller impeller and getting some ABEC 11 bearings fitted, I decided to take it out and test it with 100 freaking PSI. Right, so I'm out in the garage. I've got the air raid siren right here. I finally got all the vibrations out of it. And uh, the compressor's at 100 PSI. I am not going to touch any of this audio, so it is 100% raw straight out of this microphone. And I've got a GoPro rolling on the decibel meter on my phone. So let's see how freaking loud this thing can get. Right, so at idle, it's at 31. All right, here you go. Three, two, one. Oh. So, for some reason this washer that's in here is not quite big enough to push the whole axle to the, um, to the left. So, yeah, this impeller will rub against the back if you don't have a proper size washer. So, I'm going to hold it upside down for this. And here we go. So the max we read was 84.5 decibels, which is like a very, very, very loud street. So after this very short and very successful project, I need your guys' help. At the, if you notice at the beginning of the video, I gave a shout out to the person who suggested this idea. Again, thank you very so much for doing that. And if you guys want your idea in a future video, make sure to hit the like button down below, consider subscribing, and also comment down below your idea. And in the last video, YouTube user XC running is fun suggested making a vacuum powered plane. So with that, thank you so much to them for commenting that. Thank you so much to you for watching, and I'll see you next month.